Hey everyone, it's Lauren here. Welcome to a new video. It has been a while. I apologize. I genuinely just haven't had the time to record anything. But today I'm back with a brand new video on brand new items. The Disney Store recently released these guys. Uh, they were spotted in New York about a week ago and then they started appearing in the UK and I found my local Disney store after I finished work yesterday and they had them all and I was so happy. So as you can see, you've got Cub Simba, Cub Nala and a little beanie Cub Nala and a little beanie Cub Simba and they are adorable. So I'm going to do one at a time and go around that way and I'll explain the retail and whatever and whatever and whatever. So if you guys are really excited for the new Lion King merch this year, leave a like rating because I know I am and we've already started getting it. So yeah, let's get right into this video. So the first plush I'm starting off with is Beanie Nala. Now I am so happy with the fact they made new cub um, beanies and plushies because the same mould of plush of Simba and Nala has been around for like nearly nine years which is a long time so it's nice for them to have some fresh faces and look adorable. So cub Nala as you can see look at her eyes she is just full of colour. It is absolutely gorgeous. Now the little beanies have a little Lion King tag on them with the character's name and they retail for £8 or €12 Euros, depending on where you get them. America will have different prices. Um, so yeah, the little beanies are tiny, maybe like 10 centimeters tall, but um, she is really cute with her little tail and her Disney store tag. I really like the tags. I like how they stuck with the old Lion King one again from like the Simba and um, no the Mufasa plush and stuff. So the inside of the tag doesn't say anything. Look at me struggling. Um, literally just folds open. But yeah, she's pretty cute and I love her. I'm just so glad they finally made a new Beanie Nala plush because it's been a long time coming. So here is little Simba and I love his cheeky little smile and he has amazing colours as well. The colours of the plushies is really what sells me for plushies because the more accurate and stuff they are the more likely I'm going to buy them. So I really like him. He kind of reminds me of an older Simba um, that Disney store beanie just of his face and like his ears and stuff. And I really like how um, it's just his face. He just looks really cute and you can see his little pudgy belly and stuff there. So he is... Um, the same price as Nala, obviously, because he's a beanie, so he's £8 as well, and that's his tag, um, €12. Euros. And he's a little tail in his ears, but I really, really like his face. I just think it's really accurate, and he looks so cute. And I honestly, I can't wait for the more plushies, even though my bank is going to die, but it's going to be totally worth it. So here is Simba. He kind of reminds me of a bigger version of the Walt Disney World beanies. Um, he is really cute and I love his face. He kind of looks like he has a really square face. But honestly, I think he's really, really nice. And his little hair tuft. That they finally got the right colour. Because um, normally the hair tuft on the Simba plushies are brown. When they should be like a blonde colour. Um, so yeah. The same with his tail as well. Um, and the Simba plushies, the kind of older ones, he has blonde tail tuft for instead of brown, um, which is <laughs> movie accurate. He is like the medium style plush in a laying down pose. And let me just get his tag. He has the Lion King tag as well and he retails for £20. Oh, £20, 30 euros, or will probably be around $20 when he comes out in America. He is really cute. And then one thing I want to point out, um, the main reason I'm thinking there's going to be more plushies, because it's probably going to be obvious, um, is because on the new Disney Store plushies, when they release a collection for the anniversary, it will say um, however long the anniversary is. So, for example, Up plushies just got released, so there's like um, Kevin and Doug and um, Russell and Mr. Fredrickson. It says Up and it says 10th anniversary, whereas the Lion King tags won't say anything about an anniversary. So there's probably going to be more plushies, which I'm so excited about, as you have already said it like for three times. But yeah, Simba's really cute and I really like his facial expression and once again his colours. He's a nice golden colour and I love his little pink nose and his embroidered eyes and his ears. Um, A lot of people don't like him and I'm like, why? It's so cute. But yeah, there's his little touch tag as well since the Disney store are no longer doing stamps. He's a, like, quite a floppy plush as well, that's why I kind of thought he looked similar to the um, Walt Disney World plushies that you can kind of see which are stuffed in there but yeah um, he is really cute and I'm so happy the Disney store have done new ones and there's like his under fur he's just a big cutie and I love him so here is Nala she is probably my absolute favorite of the set just because well like the beanie look at the color of her eyes it's just so pretty it kind of reminds me of the 2011 Nala plush oh there's my finger with like her blue glittery eyes 
um but yeah she is so 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 cute and i love her little face and her ears i like her because she's kind of movie accurate except she has highlighted pop pads where nella doesn't have any pop pads but i don't care they've made a new blush that makes me very happy um so yeah she's pretty cute with her turquoisey eyes and i like as well the um under fur on their eyes well they're under eye lid i should say it's like a kind of shiny material so the plushies kind of pop out more you can see it on simba as well and i thought that was a really nice touch so nala's tag is the exact same and it says nala and retails for 20 pound or 30 euros but yeah she's really cute as well and she's pretty movie accurate as well with her light color for her tail and a little underbelly but yeah, I'm so glad the Disney store finally made new Simba and Nala plushies. Like I said, it's a long time coming and it's about time. I mean, we've got the 25th anniversary and the Lion King remake. So I'm really happy they've started to up their plush game, especially with the Cubs. Because at least it's a start. And she's so cute. So there you have it. There is a quick review on my four new plushies that the Disney store have released. Now, people have been asking me loads and loads of questions. So I'm going to go through them one by one. First question is, do I know when they'll be online? And as far as I'm aware, the Disney store said it is will be soon, probably in the next this week coming or in the next again week. Um, I don't know if they're in the full of America. I know New York has the plushies and same again. I don't know um, when they'll be online, probably soon. And that was really the questions, to be honest. And um, I don't know when they'll be in local stores. Just ask your local stores. They'll be able to give you more information than what I can. But yeah, I love these guys so much and I'm so happy the Disney store have made new plushies of them because they look adorable. It's about time. So yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. If you have, please leave a like, rate and subscribe if you're new to my channel because there will be plenty of new Lion King videos coming out with all the new merch. And I have a trip to Disneyland Paris in like six weeks, which I am so excited about. So yeah, oh, follow me on Instagram too, at Disney Collector Lauren, where you'll be absolutely spanned with these beauties and loads of other posts if you don't follow me already. I'm nearly at 1900 followers, which is crazy. So yeah, I'll see you guys soon for another video. Bye!